What's up, people? Y'all already know who it is. Just seeing that game, man. Man, they won by like 47 points, man. Damn, that's crazy. They were losing more than that, but you know, they, you know, at least they tried, man. Um, but 47 points, that's a lot of points, man. You can even see, you know, Kobe Bryant giving out autographs, you know, on um, guy's shoe or whatever, because he, they just, you know, some people, they just big fans of Kobe Bryant, man. The dude is a beast. You know, a lot of people don't want to give him his credit, just like LeBron James, even after he won a ring. They're like, oh, you need to get more rings to be considered the best. But um, a lot, like they were saying, and Kobe Bryant and LeBron said 2012 Olympic team can beat the Dream Team. I know a lot of y'all got jokes, oh, they didn't call them the Dream Team for nothing. Oh, they can't beat the Dream Team. But it's really questionable. Because when you have like defense like they have in 2012, you really got to question it. You don't know how to how everything will go down. Will they beat them? Will it be a good game? I think it will be a good game, but don't get me wrong. The Dream Team was incredible. Carl Malone, um, Michael Jordan, Scottie Pippen. You know, it, they had a Dream Team. They didn't name the Dream Team the Dream Team for nothing. You know, they had a good lineup. 2012, they got a good lineup too. Um, back in the day, had they had different rules, but um, you know it is what it is. I just think a lot of people just gotta sit back and think about the situation, man. Don't just like say, oh, they had Michael Jordan. Um, let's just say they will win because they had uh, you know Magic Johnson, Larry Bird, blah blah blah. Don't get me wrong, they all are incredible basketball players, but you're making it seem like Kevin Durant is not incredible too. You know, I gotta look at the new generation too, what they got. It's kind of like at first when I was listening to rap music, I was like, yo, Wu-Tang is the greatest rap group of all time. Then some people might say, you know what, man, you got to look at Slaughterhouse. Slaughterhouse is kind of good, too. They on that kind of, they're not on the same level as Wu-Tang, but you really got to question it and sit back and just, you know, and look at the whole situation like, okay, if this person was defending that person, everything would change up. Your stats would not be the same. If you're going against that type of person, you know, everything, your stats will change because you have a person that can keep up with you, have the same, you know, speed and everything. But, um, uh, I think the whole, you know, Olympic team, they're going to get the gold medal. Ain't nobody going to beat them. They, the only way they beating them is all, um, somehow get some injuries. But, um, yeah, they dominating right now. They dominating. They're going to be dominating back to back. But, damn, 47 points? That's a lot to lose by. Damn. Um, sucks to be them. At least they tried though, man. They just having fun, you know. They they just fans. Some probably, some people probably just got on the team just so they can get a handshake and just you know talk to the uh, you know uh, LeBron James, Kurt Brown, you know Westbrook. He's a beast too. I just you know just to be around and just play with you know the best basketball players in the NBA right now. But um, y'all let me know what y'all think about this situation, man. Subscribe, rate, comment. Y'all already know.